Hi guys, welcome to the short video about a problem with WhatsApp web and when it says uh, phone is not connected, computer is not connected or uh, other uh, disconnected error message uh, this is about what you can do there are a couple of web pages about this but I found that there are many more options to that so I wanted to show you what helped me I had this issue here it said phone not connected and uh, when you go a little bit further try again then it says uh, try to reach phone uh, retrying 14 seconds and so on and yeah it's a little bit difficult sometimes so what's actually the problem i mean there's just no connection between the web browser and the phone so usually they have to be connected in the same uh, internet or wi-fi area i mean uh, they can uh, be connected uh, through Ethernet of course but uh, finally they have to be connected to the same router that's uh, as far as I know that's the thing here so uh, if there's a problem on either side the uh, yeah so they cannot reach they cannot talk to each other and then that's a problem so check uh, the internet connection on your computer and on your phone sometimes it can be a little bit tricky to find out I mean you can check uh, and go down into uh, i mean when you are on your computer uh, here down there's either wi-fi or if you are uh, connected by cable you can check this here you can also right click on here and troubleshoot problems and so on but uh, in my case it was not this problem it was actually more on the uh, phone side on the smartphone side of course it's always good when you maybe uh, restart the browser close the uh, whatsapp tab uh, open it new maybe open the whole browser or restart the computer but if the problem is not on the computer side it's on the phone side so usually when it says phone then it's on the phone side when uh, whatsapp web finds a problem on the computer side it would say uh, yeah computer not connected something like that so this is usually a good indication on which side the problem is so in my case there were actually two problems i found out that the auto start was not activated so usually you can go to the app i mean usually long click on the app on your phone and then you get to some info pages where you have authorizations and those things so here that this is from the xiaomi it's uh, different for every phone and uh, or it can be a little bit different so in my case it looks like this it gives a little bit of information and there's an auto start and this is really important just make sure that it is it has permission to run in the background so like usually that's called auto start so means if uh, even if the app is closed it will automatically start again and it doesn't have uh, and you have to avoid like battery saver so unfortunately i don't have a screenshot if you go down here a little bit usually there's also like a battery permission and just make sure that it is not on battery safer something like that so that's the first thing which i had to change and then the next thing that was really weird actually i mean um yeah here there are actually the passwords i mean there's a sample here like if it's connected uh, just by accident to uh, like an internet or to a hotspot which doesn't have internet uh, this could be a case i mean it could be then say like connected but no internet and in this case of course uh, these two uh, items i mean the whatsapp on the phone and the whatsapp on the uh, computer they can't talk to each other of course when the wi-fi does not have internet but in my case it was actually connected to this thing here that's the wow i mean that's the uh, wi-fi or one of the wi-fi's that's a 2.4 wi-fi of the wow router which usually works pretty good it was connected here and there was not, not even a warning there was not saying no internet it was actually okay and i thought okay maybe let's just change let's just go to this one here that's the 5g network i mean it's a little bit faster but it hasn't uh, uh, so much wi-fi uh, range i mean but uh, I, I still had some reception you can see that just four bars uh, or three bars instead of four bars something like that and uh, i switched and instantly i had connection again
So in my case, really these two things, I just switched to the other Wi-Fi. I don't know why uh, WhatsApp had a problem on my phone with this Wi-Fi. Other apps didn't have this problem, just WhatsApp. But I, I have really no clue why. And also this auto start was a, a, an issue. And these are the things which I want to show you. Apart from that, there are a couple of really nice websites. I'll put down the links into the description so you can check this out. If uh, my tips uh, didn't uh, help you, so here there's a window report there's a lot about that uh, what you can try what you should try how you can fix that and also of course uh, there's the official site uh, the FAQ from the WhatsApp uh, I'll put down also this link into the description and uh, it's about same thing can't connect to WhatsApp web or desktop and there's something about that and maybe this also can help if my tips didn't help but uh, yeah that's about it and uh, yeah apart from that uh, proper reboot uh, is always a good uh, thing on both sides on phone and computer and sometimes you just wait for a little bit and after some time the problem is solved by like itself maybe there's just something also on whatsapp i mean we know we have heard about problems on whatsapp and facebook i mean whatsapp uh, belongs to facebook and facebook has some problems network issues every now and then so wouldn't be the first time so sometimes it's just okay to wait maybe for an hour if it's not very urgent or uh, do it with some other communication uh, thing like temporary with Skype or Discord or whatsoever and then try again an hour later maybe the problem is just solved by itself so that's it for now I hope I've been able to help you a little bit with this video if you have any questions or comments or better solutions whatever you have please write everything down in the feedback area uh, I'm always happy to talk about these things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe my channel thanks for watching and see you next time